The Department of Public Safety will investigate how the University of Utah Police Department handled Lauren McCluskey's extortion case. Fox 13's Haley Higgins talked to students who say the university fails to take action unless accusations become public. Haley joins us now live from campus. Haley. Yeah, investigators are going to look for anything during the next couple of weeks, specifically talking with the people who are involved uh, with this former officer who is accused of having explicit photos of Lauren McCluskey. In the meantime, though, students say that they are outraged and that they are pushing for change. Days before Lauren McCluskey was killed in 2018, the officer assigned to her extortion case is accused of saving and showing off explicit photos submitted as evidence. I, I think this is infuriating and it's also terrifying um, for, for students on campus who are victims who will be victims in the future. The independent investigation comes two days after the allegations were reported by our partners at the Salt Lake Tribune. University Police Chief Rodney Chapman ordered the probe after expressing concerns over the thoroughness of an internal investigation prior to his arrival. The fact that they're only now looking into changing those gaps speaks to the fact that the university seems more concerned about um, you know, the fact that this is coming to light and being accountable versus actually really prioritizing student safety. Student advocates who organized the group Unsafe You after McCluskey's murder call for more police oversight and training. They also ask for accountability for the officer who now works for Logan PD. This isn't an isolated incident. It's <laughs> indicative of a larger cultural and systematic problem within the department. Now, the findings of this new report are expected to be made public. In the meantime, though, the people who were surrounded, who were involved in the first investigation, have been placed on administrative leave. Reporting live at the University of Utah tonight, Haley Higgins, Fox 13 News, Utah. Well, late this afternoon, attorney Jeremy Jones did release a statement on behalf of Officer Darris. It says in part, Officer Darris did nothing wrong and he has already been investigated and cleared. A photo was raised in a routine briefing meeting for a law enforcement purpose, specifically to determine how to properly include the evidence as part of the case. Miguel Darris did not and would not brag about a photo like that.